complying. I'm complying. You weren't earlier when you were running, so step back. Sure, my car was I'm complying. I'm complying. You wasn't earlier when you was running. Oh, now you want to comply. Now that we got the dogs out. Now you want to comply. No, it wasn't. Keep walking. Keep walking. Keep walking. Keep walking. Stop. Don't make any moves. We have a canine. You will be bit. Yeah, don't, don't mess around with them canines. They don't like nobody. What up? What up? What up, YouTube? What up? What up? What up, YouTube? You click the title. You read the page. When posting on Snapchat goes wrong. When posting your idiot criminal activities on snapchat goes wrong now listen i never understood why people break the law and record themselves doing it like we're living in a time where we are witnessing crash outs back in the day people would crash out you probably would only see it not even you wouldn't even see it you just would hear about it now you see it why because they post it they didn't want to get mad at the people like me and you watching the crash out and talking about the crash out y'all the ones that posted it now we want to roll to four thousand subscribers depending on what channel i post this on it could be six thousand subscribers either way subscribe for the vibe let's go august 2023 as a marquette county sheriff's deputy concluded a traffic stop he noticed an approaching vehicle in westfield wisconsin with his windows down, he could clearly hear the vehicle approaching due to its faulty exhaust system. Additionally, the vehicle had a few brake lamps that were not working. The driver was later identified as an 18-year-old male named Dominic, whom deputies were well acquainted with, particularly through his social media activity. The sheriff's office became aware of Dominic when he first moved into Marquette. Now, Dominic, you ain't got no business cutting up. County earlier in the year. Another law enforcement agency outside the county alerted them that Dominic was publicly posting on Snapchat via the heat map feature. Some of these public Snapchat posts depicted Dominic smoking marijuana and brandishing a firearm with a laser light while making derogatory remarks about law enforcement. Furthermore, he frequently posted requests for info on how to obtain large amounts of marijuana and made numerous mentions of selling the drug. Um, now, I'm all for, you know, keeping the criminals off the street. But if he was just selling out the dope, I wouldn't necessarily call him a major criminal now. I think he's doing a, um, he's doing a public service. Given that these posts were publicly accessible to anyone on Snapchat, the sheriff's office decided to save copies of the videos as evidence. On one occasion, while conducting surveillance near his residence, a deputy observed Dominic recording a Snapchat video of the deputy's vehicle parked in a nearby parking lot. Dominic then proceeded to share the video on Snap Maps, along with more anti-law enforcement comments. Upon initiating a traffic stop, Dominic had accelerated at a high rate of speed and turned off his headlights. Going back towards the village on Warren Street. Uh oh, Dominic about to crash out. We are witnessing the crash out. 212, I'm with him, I'm call it. Eastbound Lawrence. Eastbound Lawrence. Mm. 212 calling it, Eastbound Lawrence. Northbound Spring, Northbound Spring. They were soon able to obtain the registration of the vehicle, which was linked to Dominic. Now, Dominic, you doing all of that and you, you're riding your car? I think he got a hot car. He riding his car? Oh, yeah, this is the crash out. Northbound on Eagle approaching fifth. Northbound Eagle approaching fifth. Uh, I believe that's gonna. Right, I'm gonna speed this up. Like I feel like I'm in GTA and I got five stars and I'm hearing the sirens on my controller. Hate that. Wait, I know the whole video is not just a damn high speed chase. I don't, okay, they finally catch up to him. <laughs> finally. I are questioning about its status. <laughs> Show me your fucking hands. Show me your hands. You are under arrest. Step back. I'm about to comply. You weren't earlier when you were running, so step back. Sir, my car was stolen. I'm complying. I'm complying. You wasn't earlier when you was running. 
<laughs> oh, now you want to comply. Now that we got the dogs out. Now you want to comply. No, it wasn't. I saw you with it. Step back. Step back. Get love. Watch. Watch that bad man. Watch him. Walk back. I'm weak. Not him talking to the doggy. Boy, he said, watch that bad man. <laughs> Here. Shut up and listen. Walk backwards. If you make any stupid moves, my dog will bite you. Do you understand? understand. Watch him. It's going to be your opportunity so you don't get yourself in trouble to talk to us when we're done, just so you know. Good boy. Yeah, he's getting out. Watch him. Boy. I said it's going to be your opportunity to talk with us so you don't get in trouble. Keep walking. Keep walking. Keep walking. Keep walking. Keep walking. Stop. Don't make any moves. We have a canine. You will be bit. Yeah, don't don't mess around with them canines. They don't like nobody. They racist as hell. They don't like black, white. They don't like nobody. 1095. Watch him. So boy, you don't mess around when it comes to running up here. I saw you in the driver's seat. I have it on video. I don't need to talk with you. Just so you know. Okay. What do you got on you? 1095. Hmm. Interesting. Listen. I don't need to. It's a Volkswagen. I am screaming. Hit me out. No, I don't need to. You sound like, you know, you arguing with your shorty and she want to keep talking or you arguing with your dude to my ladies and, and you know what I mean? And y'all just going back and forth and they trying to explain themselves, but you know they lying. You're like, please, like, just say, don't even waste your time with the lie. Just hold on to that lie. Gotta, I don't need to. It's, I already saw you. It's wired You're right running. to the st starter somewhere. You can see it's got to push the start. Tonight. If you go find it, it's got to push You can argue with the start. video. You can argue with the video. That's fine. I have it. Uh-huh. And then they continue to lie to you and you got screenshots. And they just like, no, that's not. you like, yeah, yeah. argue with the screenshots because I got proof. And they just continue to lie. Then they're probably a Sagittarius or a Taurus. Either or. We have a lot of video lot cameras here. You're under arrest, so. Puss, go boy. Can I talk to Jay before I nope. go? Nope. Right. So, haven't you around in small town? Why you got then I'm still bringing it back to the relationship part. And then they're like, oh, well, can I stay one more night? You're like, nope, call the person you was texting or whatever, you know what I mean? Got him. Get up there. Go boy. So, this is going to be your opportunity so you don't get in trouble. Yeah. Okay, obviously, we saw him. Can I talk about man? Can I talk about dog? Driving that vehicle and he ran from us. The Volkswagen. Because you picked him up. And so it's your your cooperative. That's my girlfriend! My son is in there! You're transporting a felon right now. Okay. Where did you pick him up at? In Adams. Okay. And why did he have you come pick him up there? You said that his car was broke down. Okay. Who else is in the vehicle? Okay. My son is in there! Baby! Don't Wait, time out. They had a baby, a whole nother. Yo, it was damn near a family car full, and they was doing all of this? I thought it was just him and the V. Now he got this whole family. He got his mans in them. He doing the most. Take him! So is this your truck? That's my father's. Please! That's my son! Yeah, he's in a lot of trouble tonight for what he did earlier. That's, that's, why, I, that's why I told you straight up. So I told you straight up, if you... We know what happened. Wait. What? Who's his father? I'm up there. You said that his car was broke down. Okay. Who else is in the vehicle? Okay. My son is in there! Baby! Don't let him take him! So is this your truck? That's my father's. Please! Okay, the truck, okay. That's my son! Yeah, he's in a lot of trouble tonight for what he did earlier. That's, that's, why, I, that's why I told you straight up. So I told you straight up, if you... We know what happened, yeah. and you're the one that's transported him. Yeah. So that's why I'm trying to keep you out of trouble. I would have never went and got him. Okay, all right. I'm straight up. I don't know where his vehicle is at the moment. Okay. I picked him up at a buddy cell. Yeah, I think he lying. I think he ain't know. But I think he know he just holding it down. Drop a comment. Okay. I'll let you walk out back to the truck so you can get a little bit more comfy, all right? Thank you so much, I do sir. need to grab your ID, though, okay? Well, you need help? No, no, no. It's... So I'm just going to be honest with you. If I find out that you're lying to me, I will arrest you and charge you with obstructing, and your kid will go to social services. Do you understand me? I understand. I'm very aware. I've been in situations like this. Okay. When I was a kid, I was around on a four-wheeler, slid off it. What? He know. Because now you're just talking about a bunch of stuff that we ain't asked you for. So you're trying to distract me with the okie doke. He know. Okay. I broke a bone in my back and it never grew in there. Right. Did he send any messages to you at all about what transpired tonight? His phone is off and so is mine. So how did he call you? Uh, the house phone. He wants to ask somebody. Any weapons in the vehicle? No. Any drugs in the vehicle? No. So if I deploy my dog, the dog's not going to alert. See, here's my thing. If you don't know nothing that's going on, then how you know is no. How you know? I'd have been like, I don't know. I don't know nothing that was going on. I just got in the vehicle. I don't know. I don't know what he got. But you all know. No, you so certain. But you don't know what was going on. Shut up. She lying anything in the vehicle no. mr is that true what's that if i deploy my dog around the vehicle for a free air sniff he's not going to alert to anything in the vehicle i don't think so shouldn't see i like his answer i don't know 
Because I don't even know nothing going on. The last time I checked, it wasn't no weapons, but I don't know what, the, what's the name? Demonic, whatever. I don't know what he got going on. Well, I know that. When you went and picked him up from the four-way in Grand Marsh, was his black vehicle there? I didn't see it. It's too dark for me. I can barely see at night. So how did he call to get a ride? He called from his buddy's house. Can I get in the car? You can hold the keys. I'm not going nowhere. Well, I know you're not going anywhere. I'm weak. I know you're not going anywhere. Shut up, Stabler. You think he's Stabler or some shit from SVU? Hey, Deputy Zimmer over in Marquette County. I'm looking to see if you're one of your deputies could go check uh, residents for me. Yep, he made a poor decision tonight. I'm sorry for you guys coming out here like that. No, that's, that's why I told you. I'm straight up trying to give you the benefit of the doubt because, like I said, I have him on video. Yeah. And if you guys start to try to live on his behalf, that's when you start looking up a criminal, a tree here. So that's why I, I gave you that warning before we did anything yeah. else because I, I mean it when I say it. Like, there's no tricks here. I, yeah. Oh, and she's... Yo, he looked like he never skipped not one meal. Not one meal. And I want to say this to anybody that's in this chat. Health? I said the chat. It's not even a chat. I'm about to just post this. Whatever. Y'all know what I mean. Health is wealth. Health is wealth. It's raining? Whatever. Health is wealth. I can't stress this enough, okay? It's nothing it's nothing to be ashamed about, to be overweight, but you should not be proud neither because health is wealth. And nine times out of ten, if you're overweight, you're unhealthy. I said nine times out of ten, not all the time. Some people do have certain disorders. Some people metabolism, you know, doesn't work as, as well as others. And that's 100%. I, I understand that. But what I'm trying to tell you guys is health is wealth. All right? So get in shape. Do right. Eat good. Health is wealth. All right? After this video, go work out. I actually worked out before I actually started this video. So if I could do it, you could do it. Let's get it. It's underage, by the way. Yeah, I know. It's his other half. Yeah. Mm -hmm. we, we know everybody that gives us problems up here. I'm looking to see if one of your guys can go out there and see if the suspect vehicle from our pursuit is out there. We have him in custody. Someone went and picked him up, and we got him stopped here in our county. So what's his charge? Uh, oh, he's going to have... So they was, they was following him, right? I guess they lost him, and then somebody picked him up. I am screaming. Like, what? The police did terrible with this GTA. Like, how he got away? He went from five stars to one star to no stars then at some point because he got picked up and all that. Of uh, second degree, reckless endangerment, and safety, felony flea elude. He's got an open case right now for disorderly conduct, so he's going to have bail jumping. A um, bunch of traffic tickets. I got to see if it's still open. I just know he has arrest. Yeah, he posted his cash bond, though, so that would be bail jumping for it because he committed another crime. And it's really dumb of him when we know who he is because he likes to flaunt his stuff on social media, which I'm going to go back to my squad. I'm going to show him all the pictures we have saved of him. So. Yo, I told you see how he talking. I'm going to show him all the pictures we have saved to him because he likes to post his criminal activities on social media. The police be on Snapchat, Instagram, Facebook, all of that. I'm telling you faithfully. They're in your followers. They they, they them spam pages. you like, yo, who this weird spam page? the police. That is the police. Go away. Yeah. <laughs> So I'm, I'm letting you know. I mean, stay clear. We know. I know this truck. The reason I stopped this truck was because I know this is parked right at your apartment complex there. I, I know there's a high probability that he's inside of it. <laughs> there's no when you're when you're in a small county. It's just that's just how it is. I just have you close the door and I'll. Okay. There is a. Hold this. In here. Yep. That's fine. Put your arm in the vehicle. Here, it's the garage. Oh, we can pause the alert. Just be honest with me. What are we going to find in the vehicle? I don't know. I don't do any drugs. Okay, well, he smell, He reeks of weed, so. He does? Yeah, he does. It was on the oh, back tailgate here, yes. Not so. me, though. I right, don't know. okay. Well, you see, you listen to that tailgate or something. See, I can't live somewhere where you where weed ain't legal. We talking about eat reeks of weed. And so I just smoked seven blunts. It's legal. Like, America got to get it together. Like, that is ridiculous. Well, well, I heard Australia uh, laws are kind of worse. Like, they actually got to go to, like, dispensaries and get, like, IDs and all types of shit to get the dope. So, I guess. But even still, they still got to do better. Like, how I'm able to talk to y'all right now, smoke the dope, legally, and be, and be cool, and they about to go to jail for smoking the dope. Like, that just, it makes no sense. Somewhere just for his pain and everything. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. Cool. Driver said that he got a call and said that his vehicle broke down and he needed to ride back home. So I'm pick him up. Well, driving the way he was driving, I don't... Mm -hmm. Not surprising that it broke yeah. down. And the best part is this I have him on video. Because yeah. I can clearly tell who he is. Right. Love it. 
So anyone told you what's going on? So your boyfriend led four of us on a high-speed pursuit through Marquette County, through the village of Westfield, and out into Adams County. Um, so he's going to jail right now for felony eluding. Mm -hmm. Okay, so uh, that's where we're at with that. Okay. Um, did he have anything on him, or do you have anything on you? No. Because the dog alerted to the vehicle, so I'm going to be searching everything in the vehicle. He gave it to me. You can ask him. It's his. It's marijuana. Oh, okay. It's his. Perfect. Where am I getting transported to? You're getting transported to the Marquette County Jail. That's over in Montana, correct? Sure is. Is he running weed? I mean, there's... No. Oh, absolutely not. I know no. that for sure. You sure about that? Yeah, no, absolutely. So all the that he posts on the snap map and everything else? About... Yeah, no. He uses that recreationally. He doesn't... He doesn't know I'm... I swear to you, he doesn't. Because the that he posts on the snap map, I mean, come on. First of all, you're not even the one that got anything to do with anything. Why are you even talking to them? Like, she didn't, you ain't even get your rights read to you because you're not even being detained. Nothing is going wrong. Like, you have nothing to do with this. you just in the car. That's fine. The most they're probably going to ask you, you know, anything? Nope, I just was in the car. Like, what are you doing? You're doing, you're doing a lot. Yeah, that, we we can know. agree that that's not recreation. I know. And I'd be willing to bet that if I went as far as to get a search warrant or petition the court for a search warrant for your house right now, nothing there. No. So he probably delivered all of it wherever it was going. He doesn't sell. I'm telling you straight up. He's asking for people to buy from him on the Snap Map. I don't have him. I don't check Snap Map. I don't. I barely use Snapchat. I'm not on my phone ever. I mean, he's posting. He's posting this to the public. Like when you guys were at camp. Yo, he is reaching. He is reaching. He's horrible at it. He's horrible at it. Like, just let's leave this for the detectives, okay? Around. Yeah. What did you post then? He was soliciting people to buy dope from him. Really? Yeah. Oh, I have no idea. We're very familiar with him. He's t making comments about popping cops and doing all this other stuff on there, too, about having oh. firearms. He, there's pictures of him with the firearm on the, there was, on, on the snap map. Oh, I have, I honest to God have no. So, obviously, we have the, the marijuana issue yeah. that with him. What else is in the vehicle? Like I said, I don't want to go move your baby and all this stuff. Yo, bro, like, I'm about to just say, take my baby out the car and search the vehicle so I can go home. Because you keep asking me this. I told you I don't know already. She did say that. That's the funny part. So now you're asking her what else is in the vehicle. She just, like, what, what, what are we talking about? Stuff because if, if I have to, we're going to be getting yeah. human services I mean, involved and everything there's else. There's nothing that I know of. Okay. Dominic's vehicle was eventually located by a neighboring sheriff's office. Adams County's out with that vehicle. Who's ever the least involved if they want to head over to where they found it. And follow back to impound. <laughs> what are we doing? This guy's an asshole. <laughs> Great. Just arrested somebody today. Yeah. Love this. Ew, she let him climb on top of her. She is the ill. She is ill. That slider. Hi there. Mm hmm. And we're taking your car. Yep. A couple things to remember is just uh, one, the second you moved up here, I put out an officer safety bulletin because you like to flash your gun around Snapchat for some stupid reason. Okay. I have pictures of you from social media doing stupid stuff. All that stuff is saved. All that stuff's going to be in the cloud. All right. We know where you live. But I know you're going to be in that truck. Exactly. We know everything about you. I could see in the back of the car. I could see when I was looking through your rearview mirror that it was you. I'm not BSing you when I say I, I have everything I need. That's why I don't need to talk with you. I'm letting you know from a standpoint from us, when you come up to a county where we will chase you for any reason, as long as we need to, the only reason I stopped was because I knew who you were, and I didn't want to go too far into the other county and leave my guys, you know, stranded to handle calls by themselves. I want you to know all this stuff for your benefit, because you still have a chance to possibly... Yo, he looked like he don't even care. Like, yo, this cop just talking. He looking like, yeah, whatever. Eat a dick, eat a dick, eat a dick. Like, he does not care. Hopefully turn this around. All right. I mean, this is all stuff that you could have gotten away with when you lived in Watertown. Not here. All right. And I'm not joking with you. Like, I know everything about you from the second you moved up here. And the reason was is because I have connections all around the state. And they said, hey, this guy's up your way. Here's all of his social media stuff. I said, great. Sent that all that stuff out to the department. Easy peasy. When we have problems with people or we have people that cause us problems, we know everything about them. So we only have 17,000 people here. Okay. So I'm just letting you know that from your own. Nah, only 17,000 people? Oh, no. 
Maybe it's because I'm from New York. That's that's too little. I need a lot of people so that way you just, you know, st stuff that could get overlooked when there's so much people, you know? From standpoint, moving forward. I know you got fired from Breakbush last week. I know everything, okay? I'm not joking with you here, okay? I know I don't I'm very straightforward. Sometimes it rubs people the wrong way. I let people know exactly everything I know. He gives me just like he gave vibes. Like he part of the family. That's okay, you know what I mean? Living your truth, my boy. But yeah, he just cause he's doing too much. Like he remind me of one of my gay homeboys. Like, yeah, I'm just telling you a bunch of stuff that I don't really need to tell you, but I just want to talk to you just to prove my ego to you like bro you already got him clearly he knows that you know but you wouldn't just say that you know what i mean i mean my gay homeboy and that's cool but just living your truth my boy no there's no secrets with me you know and you know i'm not BSing you when i'm telling you this stuff <laughs> so and i don't and i can't even put this in any court of law or anything because you're in custody technically i'm just doing it more or less for your benefit mm -hmm. See, yo, if I got some gay homeboys in here, you know what I mean? Drop a comment. Don't he remind me? Don't he act like y'all a little bit? Y'all know how y'all get when y'all got some shit and y'all know y'all got some shit. Y'all know it's the truth. Y'all just want to tell everybody no matter what. That's how y'all could be. I know that. That's why I have somebody gay homeboy. Be like, what? If he got some shit for me, he like, I'm going to tell you this. I don't care what you say. Then once he tell me, I'm like, right, I got it. He still want to tell me more, more, more. That's how he has me. For my benefit, the whole thing, I don't have any more problems with you. What's it? So right now, what he's booking you in on is felony flea looting, felony second degree reckless endangering safety, possession of the THC. I believe you're still on bond, so it'll be bail jumping. I have to confirm your DOT record because I know you've had problems in the past with driving to see what your L at license status wise. The two big ones are the felony flea and eluding. And because, I mean, I'm guessing that uh, you probably see the YouTube videos when people are turning off headlights and stuff and driving the opposite lane of travel. That doesn't change anything we do. So that's why the second degree recklessly endangering safety is on there because we're still going whether you do that or not. And you're endangering everybody else on the roadway. So those are the only two felonies that you got. The others are just misdemeanors for now. Okay. I'm definitely going to be on YouTube. Dominic was charged with felony vehicle fleeing eluding an officer, misdemeanor counts of reckless driving, endangering safety, second offense, and bail jumping. He also None of that would have happened had he would have just stopped for the cops. Like, what? Received multiple citations totaling over $700 and was released a few days later on a $250 cash bond. All of that for nothing. This I don't understand police. Yo. It, it just be the ego, son. About five months later, Dominic was found guilty but only for the reckless driving charge. The other charges were dismissed, but remained on record. Additionally, all citations except one were dismissed. Ultimately, he was sentenced to 30 days in county jail, which will be served consecutively to any other sentence he might have. I'm weak. Y'all subscribe for the vibe.